People are expected to join the first ever gay pride celebrations in the San Ynez Valley. A News Channel reporter Patricia Martellotti joins us live in Solvang to share what it's all about. Patricia? Well, it's getting really lively out here. Hopefully you can hear me. I'm sure you can hear all the music and action going on behind me. This is the first day of the Santa Ynez Valley Pride Week. And the first show, which you're listening to right now, just started an hour ago. Thank you for being you. <laughs> well, thank you for supporting me. Harry Mullen is from Los Olivos, where he says life wasn't easy for him. Well, I grew up as a bisexual in the San Ynez Valley, which has had some difficulty alongside it. Mullen says he experienced isolation growing up. My family was supportive and I had supportive friends along the way, but a lot of the community sees me as less than or not equal to, so I really felt like I had to prove myself to the community. As Pride celebrations kick off in his backyard, Mullen and his friends couldn't be more thrilled. And I see our events and the creation of SYB Pride as kind of the breaking of a dam. And we're doing stuff here that can't be undone. I needed to launch this event because this is my home, this is my community, and representation and visibility for the LGBTQ community has been lacking significantly. So I just needed to come out and celebrate in a big way. The main event will be on Saturday, starting with a pride parade right here in downtown Solvang. And the parade will be at 11, just going through Solvang, and then the festival immediately follows really in the heart of town. Really excited to um, get you know the community together, really family-friendly events. We're making progress that is going to stay with the San Inez Valley. Tonight's Pride celebration will continue until 8 o'clock right here at Dana V Winery. For now, live in downtown Solvang, I'm News Channel reporter Patricia Martellotti. Let's send it back to you in the studio. All right, thank you, Patricia.